So this is Ty with Status Quo. Um, we're out here at the Bernie Sanders rally. We're in downtown Los Angeles, and I'm here with, what's your name, bro? Gardner Smith. Gardner Smith. He's uh, originally from Tennessee, but he's been out here for like 28 years. He's uh, been in L.A. for 28 years, and um, he came out uh, to, I don't want to, I don't, I, don't, I don't know if you came to support or not, but let's back up just a little bit so I can mm -hmm. make sure we're friends. So tell me what got you out here, man. Uh, I came out here to, to listen. Uh, yeah. I came out here to uh, see if uh, the Sanders campaign was going to reflect uh, me and my experience, you know, in the United States. Yeah. Uh, I'm a young man, but my grandfather was born in 1888. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. His grandfather, his like grand eight years after emancipation. Yes. Yeah. And his grandfather James was born in the early uh, 1800s. Okay. And then his father Abraham. So my grandfather's grandfather was was born in the 1700s and and we've been in the united states for over 400 years yeah. uh we've owned land in the united states for over 100 years uh but yet and still um i'm for medicaid for all uh, I'm, I'm for rights for other people but i don't really see anyone um kind of standing up for rights of of, of foundational black americans and and I wanted to see what Mr. Sanders had to say about that, and uh, I just I just haven't seen anything. So, as I was telling you, I am a citizen. Yeah. I was brought up to be a citizen. For sure. You know, my father served in the Korea and Vietnam, mm -hmm. and uh, my uncle served in both wars, both receiving Purple Hearts. As I said, we've been stakeholders and landowners in in this country for a hundred years, mm -hmm. and uh, we've been here for over four hundred years. Yeah. Uh, things have not changed at all. At tell all. me, tell me, like specifically, like what do you, what, what do you want to see uh, the candidate um, address that he has? I mean, right now, this is a specific, okay. this is a specific thing. This is yeah. about Medicare for all, so he's yes. not like laying his plan out. But he's been running now for over, I think. He was when he did his. It was in February in in a, in Brooklyn, the Brooklyn College, where he first announced. So it's been a while, and you 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 feel that you haven't heard what you want to tell me. What you what you need to hear um, to encourage you to maybe jump on board or something. What are you not hearing? Okay, um, I myself live a life of relative ease and luxury. Yeah. I'm, I'm here during the day because mm -hmm. uh, I owned my own business and uh, that get, gave me the flexibility and, and the resources, you know, to be here. Yeah. So everything that I'm talking to you about, my, my issue isn't um, so much with Bernie, but the Democratic Party. Man. I mean, and, I, I, and uh, the, the, as a foundational American and as individual that's been on the front lines of, of, of human rights, yeah. I've been on the front lines. Yeah. I, I've spent over hundreds of thousands of dollars to to make sure that th this this country's human rights succeeds. I, I worked in the environmental and, and food policy area okay. for the last 28 years here in Los Angeles. Yes. And what, what I'm saying to you is that uh, I, I've, I, I, I've been to the group meetups mm -hmm. for Howard Dean. Mm -hmm. and, and I just happened to bring my, my wife, who just happens to be Asian, who's apolitical, mm -hmm. because I wanted her to get involved in the process. Okay. And, and when we went to the Howard Dean meetup, you have a politically active person that wanted to discuss politics, yeah. and they, they moved me into a corner, wow. and, and everyone surrounded my wife because I guess he was missing an Asian demographic. I supported, you know, the Democratic Party uh, with Barack Obama. Okay. You know, um, it's obvious that, that he was the, the best candidate yeah. for the job. It's yeah. obvious that he. Is, is, is heads and tails over number 45, yeah. but it's also obvious that uh, still the issues were not addressed. I agree 100%. What I'm saying is that I've been on the front lines. I, I, I've, I've raised money for LGBT, uh, L LGBT rights. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I've, I've raised money for human rights. I, I've sponsored Dreamers, yeah. DACA, and, and I can't get the Democratic Party to look at my foundational people and say a wrong was done. It's a labor dispute. Um, it's just. Mm -hmm. And put, there was a promise made. And there was a promise made. Put reparations on the ticket, Democratic Party, or you have politically active 
politically astute people like me who are going to listen, but if I don't see any traction, um, there's a whole contingency of us with resources, yeah. you know, with, with intelligence uh -huh. and, 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 and with uh, the will that we want to break the party. Sure. Hey, I don't know. Maybe I guess you assume, dog, everything you said, I agree with. Everything that you, like status quo, that's exactly what we stand for. I don't even fuck with the Democratic Party. You know what I mean? The only reason that he fuck with the Democratic Party because he know it's a hard, it's a, it's a hard chance to be in the Green Party or something like that. So he got to be a socialist Democrat. But he wasn't even messing with them as well. But they, so this is the thing. I, I think they've undermined everything. It, since, since we've passed um, the Civil Rights Act, they've been, putting legislation in to undermine that, you know what I mean? Everything everything has been, the Democratic Party is the, the way the criminal justice system is now, the, the reason why we we have the highest population in the state, in the state, the state penitentiaries, is a cause of democratic legislation, period. Policies, legislations, mm -hmm. so, so what I'm saying to you, I didn't know what I was running to in this interview because I am first an American citizen. Sure before I am either Democrat, Republican, Independent, Green Party, or whatever, I'm an American citizen. Yeah. Am I? Though, you know, I have- Exactly, question. exactly. Now, really, now, now I, I've taken up the yoke of being a citizen. Mm -hmm. I put in the work and the time of being a citizen, but to be quite honest with you, I have never been treated like a citizen. I'm talking to you right now yeah, as a man with security, yeah. you know, in my physical life. Yeah but I'm not able to enjoy it. You had the advent of the fifth industrial revolution happening. You have artificial intelligence. Mm -hmm. You have the singularity, which means the, the internet things. It means the merging yeah. of, of, uh, of uh, a biological uh, systems with the silicone all, systems. All, all that information. You know, all the, you, all the data points, one. all the data points, your phone, your data points. You, it's you, copying it and, and making a memory of it. Yeah. Uh, you, 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 you have, um, you know, the Internet of Things where, you know, your refrigerator, you know, is going to be able to send information to the Department of Water and Power to say when you're at home. Wow. I mean, these are all things that are converging along with environmental degradation and, 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 and climate uh, change, which are going to hit our entire nation like a tidal wave. Yeah. So, so what I'm saying is, is that I am Gardner Smith III. My grandfather was born in 1888. Yeah. If he can experience the first industrial revolution mm -hmm. and being promised, mm -hmm. you know, by America what they were going to well, do and not happen, if they were going to happen to the, the second, for the, that's dealing with this like revolution, like it's, it's second, yeah. third, fourth has been all on our, on our backs. And, it's, and what I'm saying to you is that no one can accuse me of being a bot. No one can uh, claim that I am uh, homophobic. No one can, f can, blame, can claim that I do not support immigration. Um, but well, what, what, what I can say is that I can claim that um, um, the Democratic Party and the Republican Party have triangulated the foundational black Americans and you've given us no choice. Yeah. You know, so... Uh, I think the Democrats are just like Republicans to me. They just care about women's rights and gay issues. That's it. But they, they get money from the same people. They're, they're, um, I care about women's rights. I care you know, about... I'm just saying, like, like the, 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 the Republicans... I mean, Democrats always try to differentiate themselves from Republicans like, as if it's night and day, and it's not. Like, it's they, not. they have the same intentions. It's not. It's, it's, not. not at all. It's, 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 it's not at all. And um, I don't like how this country in general, the Democrats and Republicans, uh, use uh, foundational black Americans yeah. as... As uh, um, they, they they use their their pain and, and their experience and, and their oppression to move their mm. objectives forward. I don't I don't I don't I don't like being used in that way, especially when I'm not being heard. What do they call that? Um, exploiting. Exploitation yeah. rather than rather than cooperation. Exactly. And it, it's just if they want to listen, you know we. We want to. We want to participate. We have been. We built this country, yeah. and uh, 
And, uh, you know, for anyone, I was so offended when Oprah Winfrey was talking to, you know, I don't know, she wasn't talking to me, but yeah. talking about, oh, you must vote, you know, for your ancestors. My ancestors fought for me yeah. to, to have life, liberty, and, and the pursuit of happiness. Mm -hmm. What Miss Nina Turner just spoke about yeah. in there for them. I've never had that. Mm. I sit in the lap of luxury. I mm. own my home. I own rental properties. I have a business. Um, I don't have any, uh, all my worries are existential. And my yeah. existential worry is that when the fifth, and double re fifth industrial revolution happens in this country, then the foundational blacks that built this country are gonna be further forgotten about mm. and left behind in the dust. Wow. And, and for me, um, I'm not gonna ab abdicate my responsibility because I eat good and, 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 and I have a comfortable place. I appreciate that, dog. I'll be trying, I, I, I hate, you know, that, that's one thing that irks, irks me the most about people when they get to a point where they make it. They, they all of a sudden, it's like, they, they forget where they come from and, and like it was, you had a skill, but if, you, if that didn't happen for you, you will still be in the same shit. Now you sounding like them telling us to pull ourselves up by the bootstraps. If you ain't got no fucking boots, how you gonna do that? You know what I'm saying? I, I pulled myself yeah. up as, quote, the bootstraps. But during, in owning my business in a period between February 2013 and May 2018, um, I have, I own a business and, and I've had LA, when I've called the police about being robbed of my business, I've had five times that, that I've had gunplay, like guns to the head. They thought you was the robber when you came. So I was the robber, I was like, hey, I'm with me waving, not, not, not me just calling them, me driving in my box truck, waving the LAPD, backing my car up into my building. Yeah. And I look to the right and, and, the, and the dude's like, he's going to shoot me. And I knew that I had to stop. And I knew that I had to become active when I looked at him and I dared him to shoot me. Because yeah. my wife has been given instructions. I'd be the last Negro that caught every, and I told yeah. him that. Yeah. I told him that and I told his, his, his officer that. And uh, the, the ironic thing is that the, the it's a shame, the, the, the person that I had helped out, mm -hmm. you know, for immigration, yeah. He's seen it all happen. He's all yeah. seen it all happen. Yeah. Didn't say it near a word. Just his head down. You know. Mm -hmm. I just went to uh, uh, a Joe Biden thing. Yeah. You Which know. one? The AARP thing that he did? No, okay. No, he did something in East LA. Okay. Okay. Met someone, a uh, female Latina that I know from riding scooters. Totally yeah. oblivious. Hey, can you take a picture of me? Hold on. No, I asked her. Can you can you just take a shot of this yeah. for me? She's like, no, no, I can't do that. I'm, I'm like, what's up? What, what's why? What, uh, what, 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 what's, 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 what's wrong about hashtag ADS 2020? What's yeah. ADL 2020? That's the American Descendants of Slaves. Oh, Same you, thing as you. Foundation. You know what? And, that, and, it, and it's crazy like, how, how many people are so uncomfortable with it. Like, y'all always talk about America being a, a, a man of their word. Like, that was a promise. That was a promise. So what? The, the president got killed and, and Andrew Jackson undermined it, but it was the promise. Yeah. You got to live up to your promise. And if it's a melting pot, why can't the base be around? Because I do consider it's a base. And, and this is how I'm, I'm, I'm feeling. And, and I'm a politically active person. Yeah. I, I'm, a, I'm a citizen. I'm not politically active yeah. I'm, I'm a citizen for sure I work I work, work for the people yeah. and so when when she would not even do that why she, what, what, what she say what was her excuse uh, she's been ghost ever since that because she knew she was wrong yeah. So yeah. I got to Biden and, and I showed him this and okay. I talked about this and I said we're not gonna vote for you yeah. the same thing I'm telling you yeah. and, and you know here uh, we ended up having a whole minute conversation okay. when I think she just wanted to be in front of the camera so so she so she's been ghost yeah. because she knew she knows that that I have supported her and the, and, and her causes for the last 28 years. Yeah. And you can't take a picture of a sign? Yeah, that's crazy. You, so it's it's it's, it's mind-boggling yeah. and it's a wake-up call for me and it's a wake-up call for all foundation foundational Americans is I, I say that if the system is fraudulent, we should withdraw for the system. Exactly. Because if, 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 if I've been putting in work, uh -huh. like real work, 
for the, for the last 30 or 40 years and I have no access, then what more do they want? But let me tell you this. I mean, if you, if you, if you, if you unpack what I'm about to say, when they wrote the Constitution and the Declaration of Independence, they wrote it with no slavery wasn't we weren't men that wasn't about us they, we, that about wasn't us. about us at all it had nothing, it had to, do nothing to do with us period yeah. period point blank mm -hmm. Pe period they did i want to know why did you have harsh eyes see do you see that yeah 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 you know you're, it's just it's just amazing to me the democrats and republicans are no different dude yeah. I, I wish that they were, but um, over 30 years of, of, of trying to work within the system, they're, 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 they're both racist. Yeah, no, absolutely, absolutely, for sure. What's your name again, bro? My name is Gardner Smith the Third. Gardner Smith. Hey, I appreciate you, man. And I like that shirt, too. No problem, man. Hey, keep pushing. I got you, bro. can't do anything about you. For sure. Thank you, man. Hope you enjoyed that last video. Hop on over to statuscoup.com where you can sign up for our email list and become a member for as low as five to ten dollars a month. Membership is how we grow. That's statuscoup.com slash join. And remember, join our email list so we can grow the revolution with you.